Hello streamers. In today's video, we will walk you through the process of locking tokens on Streamflow. After you have logged into the application with your wallet, click on token lock located in the sidebar on the left. Once you load the token lock page, click on the create new button in the top left corner. At step one, choose lock type, select time-based lock, then click next step. Step two is configuration. First thing we have to select in this step is the token that we want to lock. By clicking on the token dropdown, you can see all of the tokens available in your wallet. Select one that you want to lock. Under that, in the unlock settings, we have to set the date and time when our token is going to unlock. Once we have set all of the parameters in this step, we can click on next step. In step three, we need to specify the amount of tokens that we want to lock. Be careful when setting the amount as once locked tokens can't be unlocked before the unlock date. Use connected wallet allows us to easily set the connected wallet as a recipient. We can also disable this option and manually add the address. After we have specified the wanted amount and wallet address, we can click on Review Contract button. On the Review Contract page, we can see all the parameters set during this contract. Please keep in mind that token locks are irreversible, meaning that they cannot be cancelled or modified once they are created. At the bottom of the page, you can read the fee breakdown for this specific contract. We highly recommend reading the costs of using Streamflow from our documentation. Link will be in the description. Once you have checked all of the parameters and confirmed they match the one set during creation steps, you can go ahead and click on the Create Contract button. After clicking the Create Contract button, your wallet will pop up asking you to confirm the transaction. Good job! You have successfully created your first time-based token lock on Streamflow. For more details about this token lock, click on Go to Lock Details. In the top left corner of Details page, you can see the unlocked amount and percentage. Right next to it is the unlocked amount and tokens, compared to the total locked amount. On the right side, you can see the contract details, such as contract name, contract ID, and more. Underneath, you can once again see the parameters you've set for this token lock. And that's it on how to lock tokens using Streamflow. Thank you for being super cool and continue making the waves. We'll see you in the next video.